Now let's look at activity two. The first thing is, as required, your design might not need this step. But mine does. If you don't need this step, you just don't do it. That's what as required means. But I need to make individual views or files of parts that require modification. You can save things and components and put them in different files, or you can, uh, just as I'm going to show you, just make a, a copy of what you're interested in, move it to a new part of your uh, file, and start working. And so I need to show some modification, and I have to have enough annotation or detail so that a designer can create that part or, or assembly, uh, create the part or assemble the part as desired, and then identify exactly what needs to be done. And this is part of creating concept visualizations. Again, we're trying to show our designer exactly what we're expecting so that when they do the details, the details will match what our concept is. So let's take a look at it. Here I've made a new scene called Rod Rework. Remember, I, I from over here, I showed that item four needed to be reworked. Well, that's what I need to do. And I need to rework it so the end accepts the rod adapter from uh, and, and from the purchased mechanism. So let me go to my rod rework. And I've thought about it a little bit, and I think, well, a garage door is eight feet wide. My bed is only about uh, uh, maybe four, four and a half, five feet wide. So something's going to have to get cut off and moved. And so whatever I need to do is I need to shorten this rod to fit the bed width. I mean, I can't have an eight foot wide one. Um, and then that means that I'll have to move this bracket mount in words and I have to do it enough so there's room for the adapter and that's really all we're looking for here that's plenty for this one so I've made a new scene called rod rework and this is enough for a designer to start working with they have to get the actual garage door opener and the design for it and Find out what this hanger mechanism is and how big the rod is and how wide this total thing is and, uh, you know, if there's a mechanism in the center or not. And so that's all going to be part of, um, of the detailer's job so that this could actually be made and done. You have to communicate everything about the job. But we're still in the conceptual phase, remember? And so we're just kind of tying it down. And again, when this gets into its next design review, if the, um, if the uh, designer doesn't feel they have enough information, they'll kick it back and ask for more from the concept designer, which is you. Or they might go, yeah, I got it. I know exactly where to look up garage doors. And I know exactly what I'm going to do with that adapter. And I know how to modify this in to fit it on. So if your designer is quite talented, they could do with just this information. So that is make individual views or files. I did an individual view, a scene of parts that require modification.